Tonight, Dothan is preparing for one of its largest parades in downtown Dothan, the Crew of Coloss Mardi Gras Parade that brings out thousands. But there's a lot of work that goes into making this a fun and safe event. WDHN's Robert Smith has the story. A lot of hustle and bustle taking place here on Monument Street as float crews are making those last minute preparations for the ninth annual Crew of Coloss Parade. That Mardi Gras Parade taking place in less than 24 hours in downtown Dothan. Crew of Coloss volunteers spent the day preparing for the big fun day ahead, tweaking their decorations on their floats to make it look different, testing the sounds, and making sure all of the lights are working. With parade day comes stress, but it also brings happiness. Once we get to that point and parade starts, everything just washes away. We love to see how, how excited everybody gets. We love to see the turnout. The turnouts grew like every year. Last year, the parade saw over 30,000 people, and they hope to see 50,000 this year. This year's Mardi Gras parade that will start on Girard Street, traveling multiple downtown streets, will feature over 30 decorative floats giving out candy, beads, and music entertainment. This year, they will have some live fine tunes to go along with that. Got three marching bands. We're super excited about Tuskegee University. I don't think everybody's ready for the entertainment they're going to bring for sure. It's it's really, and it's really influenced some other college bands already have reached out and talked to the crew. and. Lee says with Mardi Gras parades nearby like Mobile and Panama City, they strive to keep people from traveling. Our parade's a little different. You know, it's not, we tried not to, you know, just copy something that was already being done. We're trying to do, give it our own kind of down south flavor. With thousands expected to attend the parade, the KOK crew also strive to keep people safe. And we need to make sure that no children are dashing out into the street to grab some, some beads. Stand back and look at us. We'll throw you beads. We'll throw you beads. We also got Dothan Fire Department. They're going to be set up, emergency services is set up. Um, of course, our friends at the Dothan Police Department are gonna have a big presence all along, along the route. We're gonna have officers on bicycles, um, command vehicles. It, it's a full court press on the part of the city. Organizers say the crew of Colossus Parade will begin as early as 3 p.m. and they will make their way to the downtown entertainment district around 6 to 7 p.m. where they say the party truly begins. In Dothan, Robert Smith, WDHN News for the Wiregrass.